Okay. Now we are going to do the second sum. Eight pastries are shared equally among four children. How many pastries does each child get? I'll repeat the question. Eight pastries are shared equally among four children. How many pastries does each child get? This is the question. So this is also division. So number of pastries, that is total number of pastries is 8. And number of children equally shared is 4 children. Okay. So we are going to find out number of pastries each child get. They are going, now, now we are going to find out number of pasties each child get. That is the question. How many pasties does each child get? I will repeat the question once again. Number of pasties, that is total number of pasties is 8. And number of children equally shared is 4. And number of pasties each child get, that is the division, you know that. So because for each child, how many pasties you have to find out. Each child get how many pasties. That is what we are going to find out. 8 is divided by 4. So you are going to divide it by 8 is going to divide divided by 4 it's a division so you must use the fourth table it's a this is a dividend and this is a divisor so first you have to compare so what is 8 is what greater than 4 so now we are going to what divided by 4 so you must use the fourth table 1 4 is a 4 2 4 is a 8 so you must write the 2 on the top so this is called as a quotient so 4 2 is 8 8 minus 8 you can get 0 this is a quotient and this is a reminder. So the answer is 2. The answer is 2. What is the answer? 2. So number of pastries each child get. So number of pastries. Again you have to write. Number of pastries each child get. 2 pastries. Okay. So number of pastries, it shall get two pastries. This is right answer for the question.